Finn Hudson Prentice guides Derbyshire to victory in club record chase. Cassie Pamid on debut for his new club once again set his side the platform. Samit Patel lower down showed attacking intent and helped his side set a daunting target of 365. Billy Godelman had been Derbyshire's shining light in their reply, coping well after losing opening partner Lewis Rees to score 64 not out. But a rain-affected first session prevented the Derbyshire captain from re-finding his feet, and the pressure told. Joey Everson once again proved his worth and picked up the breakthrough, the visitor's key man out LBW for 86. Lewis Deploy had tormented Knotts on day two, his innings of 130 gave the visitors hope, but he fell to the veteran Mullaney, trapped LBW for seven. Wayne Madsen and Matt Critchley put the big shots away as they looked to consolidate ahead of the lunch break, reaching the interval at 174 for three, still 191 shy of their target. Shortly after the restart, Jake Ball was back in the wickets. Wayne Madsen was unable to get bat on his swinging delivery and was duly given out LBW, gone for 43. He'd have his second soon after. Hossein bowled by a peach of a delivery, his off stump sent tumbling. Finn Hudson Prentice helped Derbyshire reach 200 runs and looked to find some stability for his side as he recognised they were starting to wobble. Critchley too looked to force the issue and came down the wicket to Patel, but he couldn't get bat on ball and was stumped by Moores to depart for 35. The visitors reached T at 240 for six and needed 125 runs to win from the final session of play. Hudson Prentice and Matty McKinnon forged a solid partnership at the start of the evening session. Even the introduction of the new ball failed to dislodge either man. They took their target down into double figures, but there was still a long way to go. Hudson Prentice was rewarded for his resistance with a third half century of his career. There was no stopping him. The target tumbled, the chase looked achievable for the visitors, and Knott's nerves began to show. Jake Ball gave his side renewed optimism when he picked up a wicket. McKinnon dismissed for 20 after inside edging onto his own stumps. The wicket proved to be a false dawn though. Cohen took the baton from his colleague and ran with it. Hudson Prentice continued to be a thorn in Knott's side, their hopes of victory pinned to his wicket. Hope was ebbing from the home side, and Derbyshire were in buoyant mood. A well-deserved victory was sealed by Cohen. Two runs taken from a tiring Jake Ball, and Derbyshire had their champagne moment. In chasing 365, they set a new club record, eclipsing their previous high successful chase of 350 against Northants all the way back in 1982. Nottinghamshire, meanwhile, have now gone over two years without a win in first-class cricket. That came against Essex back in June 2018. They'll hope to break that unfortunate streak when they face a Yorkshire side fresh off the back of a comfortable win.